Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our Legendary Samai campaign. This is episode 29. We pick it up from turn 148 in the autumn season of 320. Uh, we ended last episode after taking Don't right here, and uh, we can end turn. Uh, we're basically going to be making our final push to end Samajo this uh, episode. And then we'll see which uh, prince we will go after next. Well, Sima Lun, we don't have to do much. We're going to let Sima Wei take care of them. Um, we're probably going to move against Sima Yong, but his men are filtering south as he fights Sima Yue, so we'll see how that battle goes. But let's jump back in and end turn first. Hmm, Dai Wang is asking us for peace. They had enough, but I don't really want to give it to them. It's time for them to go fade away to the black. All right, and we're back to a new turn. We got a feather fan. Uh, gain some traits, not very useful ones. This one's okay. Tranquil's pretty good. Impeccable's pretty useless. Uh, this siege is still going on. They send out a new army from behind us. Hmm. We need to respond to that. None of our army can move very far this way. I think we just send him back, it'll be okay. Uh, even if he attacks the army or attacks the farmland, we'll be able to respawn next turn. Uh, we really want this temple right here. So Sima Ying is going to go secure that for us. It'll take us another turn to get there. Hmm. Should we go for the farmland? Probably. We can't get the Dong mining because it's part of um, Sima Yue's territory. And he beat us to it, basically. So now we're kind of cut off from reaching Beihai. So maybe it's best we cross the river. No, oh, we can reach it. All right. Um, we don't need to fight this. We we'll just delegate this fight. Mainly because Samaju doesn't have any army nearby. We'll be able to rest up during this end turn. Forced migration. Okay, we got the territory. Do we want population growth here? No, we don't need to. We want the replenishment. We'll do nothing. Because we don't have um, the actual commandery. We don't really need population growth in the farmland. We just really wanted the food. Okay, so that's taken care of. Our armies are spread out. Um, that's the last territory Sima Jung has over on this side, so we can pull them back now. Um, oh, Sima Lun. We're at war with them. They have the city of Ye. We could go take it. Yeah, we can take it and use it as a bargaining trip. Maybe with Sima Yong. I don't know. I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do with Sima Yong. This fight right here. I mean, I've been avoiding this fight. There's one more turn till their supply is depleted. And then they will go to attrition. I kind of want to see what they will do. They reinforced it by adding an administrator. So now there's two tribuches inside the city and then four more on the walls. Unit's quite good. We have three armies, but I feel like we should just continue siege. There's no rush here. I prefer if they come out. Um, that's it. Um, Sima Wei is doing okay. Not doing super well. Um, he is outnumbered quite a bit invading this portion. And over here, he's having trouble taking the city. Uh, he beat back their army, so maybe he can take it this turn. But once he does, then we don't really have any more enemies on this side. Uh, the Jin Empire, we're going to let them live. Uh, they're not really mad at us. Ooh, I lied. Why are they mad at us? What did we do ever do to them? War atrocity against our friends. Who's your friend? You're not friends with any of these guys. Are you war friends? Just not anymore. Hmm. I mean, I have an army behind just in case they declare war on us. 
but they're going to be outnumbered. The Empire actually has quite a few big armies. Any chance you guys want to get vassalized by us? Because that would be really great. Oh, we could get them to join a coalition with us. That's not bad, actually. Let's do that. Um, we have so many armor to give out. These are pretty bad. Do they have good items? Not quite. We can make a payment. There's nothing money can't buy. Oh, they are demanding a lot more than the other factions. But it's okay. We can pay up anything we have money 2.9 million to be exact all right so we'll form a coalition with the Zen empire let's see what our coalition is called coalition of noble comrades that well, sounds pretty good we have four vassals and then we have the Zen empire hopefully our relationship will improve but at least he won't betray us i feel like all right sounds pretty good Uh, I think we can enter now. We can just um, wait for this uh, supply to run out here. And we ready to spread out our forces. So let's continue. Okay, Sima Yan demanded their independence. Uh, they're down here. That's fine. That gives us an excuse to attack them. This army back in the south can actually do something now. And we can get another piece of Jian Ye. And then maybe we can bargain for the commandery itself. This is perfectly okay. Um, yeah, and they're offering us money to help us fight a war. Mm. Yeah, this is good. I feel like we can actually... This is what, plus 11 with her? Uh, if we give her money to the point where it's plus five i want to see if it will boost our relationship a bit more because i want to lock down our yeah 21 okay so we just 5.0 there we go get 10 more points just going to cost us 600 gold i want to build our relationship with our other vassals a bit more don't want to lose them all right so one of our vassals left us and we responded with attack and oh she's helping us attack them okay Interesting. Taishan, okay. A noble birth, a daughter to Sima Ying and his new wife. He should really thank us for giving him a new wife. A uh, new dynasty. Oh, dynasty mission. These are awesome. Okay. Spirit point. That gives us food. Ooh, this is really good. We want more food and we want more spirit points. So this is definitely the way to go. And... Develop your core into a uh, seasoned wise scholar where or see your people's need. They want nothing. Wait, what's the two options? Or see that your people's need are met. Uh, develop characters in court or do the thing for every citizen. And then we go for the many. All right, please give us an easy food mission. And we get 10 spirit points. We're just... 11 points away so 11 turns maximum because we're getting one point ter per turn for having max reformation we're almost maxed out there what's our mission have at least 75 food Ooh, we're so close mm, we need to get some more farms and then we get 15 point more point we could either get more farms or downgrade some cities or even trade away some cities 23 more food uh, not the easiest thing to get we'll think about it after this turn ends uh, let's see here all right they're gonna officially start suffering attrition now let's see if they come out fight us if not then uh we can go in and take care of them soon and over here they march themselves into the mountains here they don't have any trebuchet here we have our most elite unit do they have cavalry one two three not really significant cavalry so we could definitely take this fight 
over here, we should just attack Ye. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's at least put it to siege. Not, I don't think we need to grab it just yet. Because the problem with Ye is um, if we take it, like this turn, uh, then we're going to lose out on more food. So we'll siege. We want to get our dynasty mission finished first. Uh, this would really help out our brother over here who seems to be losing to these armies. He's getting pushed back. He lost the full stack here against their three stacks. And this is really weak. I don't know if they can handle this. I guess help is on the way. And they still haven't finished up over here for whatever reason. We have a level up. Oh, we're so close to getting that. Come on. One more level. Two new characters. I don't see any good armors on them. Ooh, silver armor there. Why do when do we miss her? I thought I made sure we didn't miss out any armors. Alright, but we're gonna grab her for the armor. And then ditch her afterwards. I mean, she's not going to be a spy or anything. Just we don't need a 65-year-old. Oh, she has brilliant. Mm, that's a good trait. She has some good traits. But we don't need her. All right, let's dump her. Let's grab a new set of missions. Engage the Falling General. Where is this guy? Ah, good thing we saved him. Uh, Mao Mao Hai. Okay, Teng Zi. All right, another upgrade. Another upgrade. Those are all doable. We don't have any open assignments, but when we do, we'll do it. We'll get this mission done right away. All right. I think we can just night battle and just pound them. Hmm. Unfortunately, it's raining. Neutralizes some of our advantage of fighting this in the forest. Conversely, we don't have to fight them in the forest. Hmm. Don't really like this terrain. The, the problem is, if we put them here, they don't see us, they're not going to come. And even if they come, we can't really hit them through this forest. So the best place to put them is play here, so they can see us, and we can hit them as they come down this corridor here. We're still going to be stubbornly using flaming shot. Probably here. Just want the range to be outside of that line right there. Okay, this works. Uh, maybe twist it a little bit. Archers right in front of them. These guys in front of them. They'll be charging forward, so it doesn't really matter. These guys can hide over here and get a flank. I kind of want to get Sima Shuo into a duel. She can chill in the back. Alright, let's start. They don't see us, but they are moving over. Eventually they'll see us. Alright, they do want to duel. Kind of want to duel him. So we have a really good weapon, really good armor, but he's a generic character, so I'm curious to see how he will do. Uh, we buffed him quite a bit. He has the melee attack speed skill unlocked, so he's going to be hitting hard and fast. Alright, now they see, they're going to see our tribuches when we hit them, so that's good. Oh, he also has gold armor. Level 7. This guy is pretty good. Let's do this guy. I mean, we're level 6. He's level 5. Level 80% 80 armor? That's really high. Armor piercing 1.1. Armor piercing 1.2. So he's probably better off fighting him. No, I want the other guy. Give me this guy. 
Yeah, I'll take him. I'll take him. Alright, let's see if it works out. Alright, we hit him off the horse. Oh, nice. Both of our general hit them off the horse. Alright, this armor looks sick. I really want this armor. Uh, both of them don't really have abilities to use. He has one that reduced morale. Oh, they see... Who do they see? Oh, they just see our units. Okay, they don't see these guys, right? Yeah, we need to hide those guys. I kind of want to see how he's doing. I feel like he should be killing him fast. Hmm, the twin sword gives a little Liu Bei vibe. And the sword's called Swarm Brothers, I think. Yeah. We should be able to kill him. Uh, but I'll uh, kill him too fast. Crap. We're gonna be surrounded. Alright, we got him. And then immediately we get surrounded. Crap. Can we get another duel off before you get killed? It's getting surrounded. We're winning the other duel too. Let's let out. Oh, no one's bothering you. Great, great, great. Oh, we'll take this. We'll take the duel. Perfect. Alright, we'll let the spear units walk by and then we'll rush out. Even though we have less health, I think we can take her on. She's a level 1 general. Come on, win over here. Alright, they're entering into our archer's range. Alright, we'll charge out. Nice. Right, now they can go attack the archers. Get on your horse. Alright, cavalry out. We'll crush this group first. And then we'll go crush the crossbow units. Go harass. Yeah, he's gonna win this, no problem. Execute her? Come on, the cavalrys are dying because you're not. Hurry up. There we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Nice. Okay, cavalry. Run off. Don't get caught by all these spear units. We crushed that unit right there. Alright, we'll let him get on his horse. Roar. Alright, once we clear enough space away from these guys. Alright, there we go. Oh, whoa, whoa. What are they doing? Get them. Reduce armor. Alright, let's all crush this guy right here. Because we can just drive by these guys. They're going to get crushed by the charge and then we can clear our way and get through over here. Alright, there we go. The yellow dragons took care of that. Get back into a line. Now, uh, the cavalry did hurt. Yellow dragons, not good against horses. But we are great against infantry, so let's go out. Come on, get through here. Don't get caught by the spear units. Alright. We'll send the general off to chase these two. And we'll get the cavalry out of here by chasing this one. And then the yellow dragons can take care of this group right here. Everyone else is routed. Their cavalry is routed completely, so we don't have to worry about that. She can go chase off someone soon. There we go. Come on, pull out. No need to fight these guys right here. Although... Yeah, I think a charge is... Yeah, they don't have morale anymore. Alright, stop firing. Don't kill our own guys. That's it, right? Why are we not yet? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna do some chasing and then we'll end this fight.
Alrighty, pretty clean fight. Um, I'm also glad we won the duel. Those are quite nice. It means all the items paid off. Uh, we didn't get his armor, but he's also not dead because he has resiliency. Alright, we fought the force, so we got that mission complete. Level up over here. We finally could pick Flame of the Phoenix. He can do some damage with his abilities as well. And I think we can give him a little chase. Mm, can't catch up to him, but that also gives him a turn to come back, which is good. Um, let's see. We can fight that soon. We couldn't get the temple because Sima Yue beat us to it. Sima Yue is beating them on both sides. So we are going to pull back to Dong. And we're going to make our way towards Taishan because they are at war with us now. So we're going to go here. And then come out here. Basically heading towards Taishan next turn. I guess we'll grab it. It's going to hurt our food for the mission, but I don't see how we can actually get the mission done this turn. I want to see if they will come out. If not, then we might have to fight this. Alright, everything else is done. Uh, we can't get the food this turn. I don't want to change any of my commanderies. Pretty happy with where things are. I mean, arguably I could change all these from selling food to um, planting food because our economy is doing so well. But it's also a reformation thing. Selling food gives you reformation, but planting food uh, loses you reformation. So we are at positive 63. And each selling food to planting food, it's like an 18 point swing. So we can't switch that many of them over. Yeah, I think we're planting food in pretty much all our commandery that has some sort of peasantry income. And they're all focused on just selling food. This one isn't. This one should change, actually. Alright, nine more food. Let's see anywhere else we can catch that needs to change. Over here, doesn't really need to change, but it could give us a bit more food. Let's do it. Alright, maybe we can push it to 75 this turn. I'm beginning to see hope. I'm basically losing income for food. Huh, why do we have a level 4 school building? Three food at a time, three food at a time. These are already all focused on food production though. There's nothing we can really do. I think the only thing we can really do is change Tongwu from selling food to uh, planting food. And then if we flip this, basically we give up money. Which doesn't really mean much to us. Alright, let's do it. Look at the change. Boom. 119. Alright, so we finished the mission. And we can definitely afford to grab Ye. Yeah. So let's just uh, automate this. Medium damage. This shouldn't be medium damage. I'll fight it and cut it out. This, this should be no damage. Alright, much better casualty count. So we got... yeah. 
that took our food down a bit, but not a big issue. They are planting food here. We don't have the farmland. We want to go the corruption reduction route here. They have... Okay, that's a good building. We don't have silk, so we don't need that one. We also have tea, so they can have this one. Uh, pretty good build. Can't really complain. Um, I think... I don't know if we can actually... We have non-aggression, but we don't have military access. We want military access with them, if that's okay. They're Sima Yun's vassal. Hmm, have to pay them for it. Not a big fan of that. I was wanting to go over here to help out our brother against his war. Or our war. But I guess not. Hmm. Maybe we can buy this territory. How do you feel about selling us this one actually? Not not this one. 30.4, that's that's doable. We have a bunch that we're never gonna use. And then we'll pay the rest with cash. We'll just simply buy it. He doesn't like us because we bought it? Went from green to yellow. Uh, because we're now more of a strategic threat? Ah, that's fine. Not a big deal. Got ourselves the farmland, boosted our food to 143. Now we can safely march over and, and attack him over here. Mm, does Sima Yun want to sell us some land? He doesn't like us, so he might be charging quite a premium. We want both of these. What's the price on them? This is the city. City is expensive. But we can buy the copper mine, which sounds pretty good to me. Here. Mm, this one's pretty bad. Give you the bronze ones. And then we'll pay you for the rest. Let's see how greedy you are, brother. How much is 9.1? Come on, make that big jump. Almost there. Alright, it's pricey, but we can afford this. Alright, so we grab the copper mine. Switch it to corruption reduction. Perfect. Now we can safely march over and help our brother out from the behind. Because he's occupied. He definitely needs the help. Um, this army is chasing that. This army is heading towards Taishan. We're waiting to see if they'll come out this turn. So let's go. Next turn. Alright, they came out to fight us. Um, so they won't have the four tribuches on the wall. And they're going to have to move their tribuches up closer to us. Because we're on defense now. So let's jump in here and beat them up. Alrighty, our reinforcements are arriving from all over the place. And their reinforcements coming from the city side. But our reinforcements not going to all show up together. Uh, this is awkward. I mean, we're going to stay in our deployment zone for sure. Not going to do anything too crazy. Now, this is one of our worst armies. No Onyx Dragons. Oh, but this can showcase the mod. Uh, these archers didn't got little hats with feathers on them. Very cool. Yeah, they look much better now. 
All right, so fire arrows on these guys. Fire arrows over here. Don't want to burn ourselves though. All right. In the front, we have a gorilla deployment on these guys, so let's be flexible here. Start out shooting, and then we'll switch over after a while. Cavalry can kind of hide. All right, let's see where our different reinforcements show up. Oh, okay, at least the group that's over there is cavalry. Just cavalry, right? Oh, two groups over here. Okay, that's awkward. And no range units. Okay. Pull this way fast. Hmm, they have tribuches in both of these armies. I feel like... We'll keep this guy here. He can go harass, sacrifice himself. So they gave us a range unit group from one army over here, and then... Hmm, at least the range unit's good. But it's gonna take forever to get that trebuchet over. Like, by the time they arrive, it's really not going to matter here. These guys are going to be useful. Oh, run. Keep moving. Don't stand still. These guys should just head up a little bit here. Who's our best dueling? Okay, Sima Jian is the best duelist. Uh, he wants to duel. High level, but no items. Okay, we'll take him. And then two strategies, and he doesn't want to duel. Does he want to duel someone else? No, he just doesn't want to duel. Ooh, Ba Pan also could duel. Nah, we'll let Sima Jian do it. He's resi uh, resistant to fatigue. I thought he was like fatigue immunity. All right, we're shooting at them. They're firing back at us. We can, why can't we should we should probably stay on the move and shoot at them? Oh, that's gonna hit. Just outside their crossbow range. Oh, they're also shooting at us over here. Let's just loop. Ooh, that hurt. Loot behind. Take care of this guy. Okay, maybe let's not do this far out. All right, she's made it. The archer's almost made it. Sword, charge. Wow, they're getting wiped by the enemy uh, tribuches. It's kind of awkward here. Maybe we should just keep moving, actually. We need to utilize our range advantage. At least we have one tribuche who can help us in the beginning. Alright, we're ooh, getting killed by archers now. I don't think we'll make it. Yep. Wasted quite a few of their shots. Doesn't hurt completely. Goodbye. Go snipe at him. Oh, it kind of sucks they split the strategists from this army away, so now these units don't have formations. 
These guys don't have... Oh, this might be our daughter's army. They might just not have it. Yep, this is the duel we wanted. Alright, they're entering our tribuchet's range. Perfect. Getting a duel off with their general. Knock them down. Oh, come on. Come on, Sima Jian. You're better than this. They have cavalry archers? Interesting. Fire these guys. We'll use our archers to take out those. Yeah, they're in position. Move out. Call them one. Call them two. Now we're murdering them. Yeah, they're not gonna make it. Sima Jian has been defeated. No, we won. What are they talking about? We have defeated whoever was fighting us. All right, time to wipe them out with our cavalry. Kill him. We have a roar, right? There we go. Get on your horse. Rear charge. Alright, which way are you gonna go defend? Alright, they got rear charged. Can we roar someone? Are we on our horse? Yes, we are. Okay. Let's crush them quickly so we can pull out of here. Pulled out of there. Because their range units came up. Time for our range units to give them some firepower. Actually, we can wipe this guy out. What are they thinking chasing us? He barely has any health. No formations here, which kind of sucks. They gotta just absorb the damage. I feel like we can attack this side. Not that many spear units there. These guys can go into... Mixed missiles? No. Melee evasion. Oh, actually, this gives them charge reflect, so that might be good. Actually, I'm wrong. It's better to just pull them back. Uh, let's micro these guys properly. They're fine. You know what? Just charge. Melee. Charge. Fire back. Alright, they're here. Let's kill the strategist. Alright, 
No need to be shy. Push out. Push out. Them. I'll take on the spear units. Fire your arrows. There you go. Crossbow units are useless. Gotta get rid of these guys. Alright, we're fine. She needs to stay back. They can shoot arrows. Alright, this is a mess over here. Cavalry 1. Charge, cavalry two, charge. What are these? These are the reinforcement army? Okay. Take care of the spear units. Roar. Charge in the enemy. We got this. We're gonna lose some of Zor Dragons in the front. Didn't really take care of them. Engage in melee. Let's go kill the other general. This is a messy fight. Now we get a nice easy charge on them. Pull them out. Flank them. Alright, they got killed over there. Should be a win, right? Who's still fighting us? There we go. We don't need to chase. Oh, we do need to chase. It's a garrison fight after this. Alright, so we'll chase and cut it out. Alright, it wasn't clean. Definitely a lot of um, friendly fire too. But, acceptable. Um, let's see, we captured Zhang Ong. He's lame now, but he's modest, ambitious. <laughs> he's modest and ambitious. Um, we're going to be releasing most of these people, unless they have the armor that we want. He's gonna give us the method of Sima if we kill him. He's the heir. Yeah, no one has the armor. We don't really need the method of Sima. More... He's the only one who we could re, uh, employ, but let's just release. And we'll replenish. Alrighty. Jin Empire, our coalition partner, helped us declare war on Sima Yang. Uh, good for them. We got a new, uh, just this lame silver. I mean, at least it's, um, could be traded. Let's see. Level up on Sima Ai. Level 9 now. We're almost level 10. What do we want? I guess we want the fire arrow so he can have it on his, um, Azure Dragons. And then out of these two, we don't really need more noble support. We can probably get more armor for his Azor Dragons or get this buff. Let's get this first, regardless. Who else leveled up? Sandy leveled up. Level 7 now. Pretty strong too. Get some uh, charge bonus for the retinue. Ooh, you don't have a good weapon. Just realized that. 
You have a terrible weapon. I mean, we don't have a good weapon for you, but I guess we'll let you have that. It's better than nothing. Okay, this battle here... They're also having noble support issue, but now we can just delegate this. Alright. Grab the city. Alright, we got the full belly. We got another dynasty. We'll crush the noble support. The noble re rebels, whatever. We'll delegate this. Ooh. Stab in the heart and then lop off his head? A little bit extra. Um, guess ransom? Alright, they need to rest up. They took a beating. These guys too. This army is pretty healthy. We can keep moving. Uh, I think we'll move back actually to Hedong. Because it feels like our brother's not making inroads. We need, he, we need to help him. Uh, they can rest up here. Ooh, we catch them out. Nice. Free win. Get some replenishment off this win. Uh, we might get his armor. He's wounded. He's going to die in this fight. So we need to capture him if we want the armor. But we'll just delegate. No point to load into a fight. Alright, take that armor off when you're choking him. Did we get it? Well, he still has resiliency? Oh, he has two resiliency. It was, it was the... Ah, uh, wrong person. Wrong person. We don't need to capture her. She can go away. Replenishment. I hope we stayed on our side. We did. I'll take the level up. We have reach. Yeah, we'll go and get hamstring. Help him with his dueling. Uh, Sima Jiong is down to two territories. Uh, he just has Beihai. We're going to crush him soon. Uh, so I guess we should turn our attention up north. Uh, they did the chasing for you, so you don't need to chase. What is this? Alright, food planning. Good. Tea house, good. Really don't need this. Um, this is fine. We gotta just switch it to something else. This is fine. Wait, what is this? Isn't this a marketplace? What is this? Wait. This is the same... This is the same building chain. How did they build two of the same building chain? What? That makes no sense. Um, what should we build here? I don't know. We don't need anything here. We could build a school just for the Reformation and Noble support points. I don't know why they have two marketplace. We'll let it fix themselves and then figure it out. Um, we have to assign some assignments. None high over here. Needs. Okay, just need anyone could do. Someone who's low level. There we go. Ejo is also. No, Ejo is a mix of all three things. Super hard to do. Zhangke is very high commerce. Yep, anyone can do as well. Changwu. Alright, we did our food mission, so we're gonna go back to selling food here. And we're gonna go back to income focused. Oh, we need to get Mao Mao Hai. Uh Tengzi and Mao Hai need to be used. Where is Mao Hai? Okay, so let's go back over here. Not Yijo, Nanhai. Instead of you, we're gonna use one of them. 
Tengzi could do it, but also more small height. There we go. We need to use him for the mission. Tang Wu has someone. He Pu. Also very high commerce. Pu Yang is so low. Need someone to buff the industry. Tengzi could do it. All right. There we go. Alrighty, um, we could build an extra building here, but what would we build here? Yeah, we have everything that we need here. Alright, let's just save the food for all the other commander we're going to be picking up. This army can head over and grab Taishan. Do they have army? They have army outside. Outside of reinforcement range too. Oh, they have tribuches here. That's okay. Uh, we'll cut it out. The fight, we'll just, we'll just cut it out. It'll be pretty easy. Alrighty, pretty clean fight. Occupy. All right, so he has an army outside the city, which is really strange. I think this might be his only army too. Let's see how they built Taishan. All right, we don't want this. It's gonna go away. Should be a tea house. All the way up. It's gonna be a trade port, huh? So it's gonna be a spice port. Uh, why can't we convert this? Why can't I go this route? We have this building. What are they talking about? It's not letting us build this route. Why is that the case? This is so weird. Um... Yeah, they have two marketplace. Is this a faction unique thing with Sima Jiong? I don't think so. Anyways, if you demolish one, the other one can be built correctly. I'm just gonna assume it's a glitch. State workshop. Corruption reducing. Alright, perfect build. Although I don't think we need to be a large regional city here. Down grade one level. Alright, perfect. Alright, not sure what we're going to do with this army. I feel like with this one army here, might not be enough to push out Sima Jiong's last remaining forces. I don't think I have a spy on Sima Jiong either. Yeah, apparently the mission to discredit faction worked. She no longer wants a defect, so that's good. Yeah, we don't have a spy. Um, let's try to pursue military appointment over here. We don't have a spy as so we can't tell how many armies he have left, but I can't imagine him having more than two at this point. What I do want is I want the temple. Is it negotiable? How much is the temple going to be worth? Uh, do we want anything else? kind of want the livestock farm, but it's not really a necessity. also kind of want the iron mine. Let's see what's the prices on these. All right, temple's quite cheap. So is the iron. I'm gonna do two separate deals here. Mm, vassalization is a possibility, but it's just a very expensive possibility. Um, all right, I'll give him this. Yeah, why don't you have authority, have a... Alright, that's pretty good. And we'll use money to buy the rest. 
and we'll buy the temple. This way our people is going to be more happy with us. And we can also do a separate deal to buy the um, iron mine as well to complete. Don't we'll win too much. Um, closer. All right, there we go. Good deal. And then we're going to do another deal with him. We'll take this. It's only 23. Yeah, that's very cheap. Uh, I'll give you more authority armor. We'll give you herdsmen. Really don't need herdsmen. And we'll give you more money. There we go. Alright, so we bought two territory from him. The temple obviously is great, plus 10 satisfaction faction wide. The iron mine, he doesn't have it built up? What has he been doing? Alright, we'll build it up. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Um, does he want a peace treaty, perhaps? He does. Okay. Does he want to become our vassal? He doesn't, okay. I was a bit surprised about that. Then we'll wipe him out. Okay, that's done. Um, I think we can end turn once we get this army moving. Let's commit him over here uh, to help out. Hmm, we bought this territory as well. So we can definitely keep marching and attack Shangdan. Shangdan sucks though. Hedong's better. But that's his capital, so I guess we have to go there. Uh, I don't want to trespass. So we'll go to the farmland first before we take this weird route over here. Actually allows us to go farther here. Alright, no one's guarding his capital. Our defense force finally has something to do. We are going to go put down Sima Yan over here. So... What's the best route? Four turns? Not too bad. Alright. So that's all our armies. Um, I think we don't have any assignments to do, so let's... Yeah, let's end turn here. Oh, our vassal is breaking a trade agreement with us. Why is that? Hmm, suspicious. Alright, Sima Yu signed a peace treaty with Sima Yu. Okay, that's fine. We got a reward for assignments. Good. We picked up a reform. Ah, back to Wavering Spy loyalties. We'll try that trick again. We'll try to discredit his cra uh, faction. Good brother. You have a mon alone among the princes remain a fellow defender of your brother, the Emperor. With you as his protector and guide, a great future awaits. Wow. Is this because I finished all the dynasty missions or something? Okay, our income is going to go kaboom. Great. That's that's awesome. Um, okay, so we're going to come back and continue next episode. This one ran a little long. Uh, our vassal here is getting a little suspicious what she's up to. Um, if we look on the map, we have coalition partner. We have one small rebelling group here. One vassal flipped. Uh, this vassal looks like they're going to flip too. Uh, we might need to send an army to take care of them. Sima Wei is doing better against the armies over here, but we are on our way to help from the other flank. So we're going to be trying to wipe out Sima Lun next turn as well. They don't have many territories left. They have one, two, three, four. Uh, Sima Jiu only has two territories left, and he himself is right here. There's an army right here. We'll chase him down with uh, our army group here, and we'll also uh, take out the capital there and rescue our older brother, the emperor. And after we're done with them, uh, we have to make a decision whether we want to 
eliminate Sima Yue first, or eliminate Sima、uh, Yong first, because they're at war with each other. We can pick a side and easily wipe one of them out with the help of the other before turning on them at the end. And then we just simply、um, wipe out Sima Liang's group here, or vassalize them, or something. And then we will just annex Sima Wei, and then it's over. So that's our game plan.、Uh, come back next time as we wrap this up. Most importantly, rescue our older brother. So see y'all then. Bye.